Germany to buy him Mars rocket launchers for Ukraine. During his visit to Washington, German Defense Minister Boris Pistorius announced Germany's decision to procure three M142 HIMARS rocket systems from the United States with the intention of subsequently transferring them to Ukraine. This procurement adds to the military assistance package announced in late April, which includes armored vehicles and ammunition. The HIMARS, a rocket system mounted on a truck, is capable of rapid and precise missile strikes over long distances. Once delivered to Ukraine, these rockets, manufactured by Lockheed Martin Corporation, will provide Ukrainian forces with enhanced capabilities with a range of up to 80 kilometers and more. The decision to supply him Mars to Ukraine comes amid escalating tensions in the region, particularly in light of Russia's continued aggression towards its neighbor. These rocket systems have demonstrated effectiveness in targeting Russian supply routes and ammunition depots, disrupting enemy operations far behind the front lines. In Washington, Minister Pistorius emphasized Germany's heightened military responsibilities in response to Russia's invasion of Ukraine in 2022. He underscored Germany's commitment to bolstering its defense capabilities, with this year's defense spending projected to be the highest since the establishment of the country's armed forces after World War II. Addressing an audience at the Johns Hopkins School of Advanced International Studies, Minister Pistorius emphasized the importance of defending international law, democratic values, and the established order in the face of aggression. He stressed that Germany recognizes the gravity of the situation and cannot afford to stand idly by as these principles are threatened. The decision to provide additional HIMARS rocket systems to Ukraine reflects Germany's determination to support its allies in the face of regional instability. As tensions continue to escalate, this move underscores the importance of international cooperation in addressing security challenges and upholding democratic principles in the face of aggression.